YouTube, what's good, man? It's your boy Lewis. For real, y'all already know the deal, man. You get it, you got it. Let's do it. So, look, yeah, bro. This vlog starting off a little different. Um, as you can see, I'm in my room. You know what I'm saying? And um, ha, ah, man. First day of May, May first, 2024, man. Um, every like every first day of the new month bro i wake up every day i wake up and just try my best to keep my energy good you know what i'm saying uh but on that first day man of the new month every time i gotta just i gotta stay positive i gotta set the tone for the month you know what i'm saying so if you're not doing that you should definitely try that i feel like uh you gotta set that tone for the for the month bro if you want to have a good month that's what i tell myself all the time Make sure you do that, you know what I'm saying? If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. If you're not new, thank you for returning once again, you know. I appreciate everybody watching my videos, sticking with me and stuff like that. I told myself, man, for this month, bro, I really just want to get more consistent with YouTube. So, my plan is this month, man, is to try to drop at least eight videos this month for YouTube. So. Eight videos is four weeks in the month. I should be dropping at least two videos a week. Um, if not eight, I know for I know I should be dropping at least five. You know what I'm saying? Um, this morning, bro, woke up with um, good energy. You feel what I'm saying? Woke up with good energy. I had to take Liv to her hair appointment. Bro, let me tell y'all about my girlfriend, bro. She never want to drive to her hair appointment. She always wanted me to take her. So I ended up taking her. Um, then I came back home like around about 10.45 and your boy went and ran three miles, man. I didn't go to boxing class today simply because my wrists and hands are kind of sore. So me and Lil was just talking about tonight when she get home because, you know, since she braid hair so much, she be having to take care of her hands and stuff too. So we going to do like a, I guess you could say like a little quality date with just icing our hands and just self-care and just taking care of ourselves and stuff like that, man, because I ain't going to lie to y'all. I really need it. My hands hurt, my wrists hurt. So as bad as I want to go to boxing class today, I didn't go. I just told myself, I was like, bro, I need to just take a break. So what I did was I just went outside and ran me three miles, came back in here, I ate. Um, so now, man, I'm straightening up the bed and still straightening up the room. And that's another small thing, bro. If you want to have a good day, make sure you straighten your bed up. That one small task can really make you feel good throughout the day. Make sure you do that. After I straighten this bed up, man, I gotta go ahead and take me a shower because your butt smell like sweat, man, running out there in that hot sun. Gotta go ahead and take me a shower, get myself together, and then I gotta do my other stuff, which is like my, my daily emails, you know what I'm saying? After my daily emails, I gotta go ahead and, um, Really just my emails, man. By the time I get done like, emailing and stuff like that, it should be time for me to go pick up Lil. I probably go pick up about four o'clock. I want to say it's like one something right now. So I probably pick up about four, come home, chill out, rest up, you know, watch me a movie or something. Who knows, man? I might go ahead and edit a YouTube video and go ahead and upload, bro, because I really... I really need to be on my YouTube grind heavy this month. I really feel like I've been slacking, you know, so that's what I'm going to focus on. Just trying to get more YouTube content out because I'm dropping a lot of short form content, bro. If y'all don't follow me on Instagram, TikTok, whatever, y'all got to go follow me, man. My socials are in the description box below. I be dropping a lot of short form content, bro. But sometimes I be feeling like I ain't going to count. Sometimes I be feeling like when I be dropping my short form content on Instagram and stuff, bro. Instagram is really, Instagram really starting to become weird. I'm not gonna lie. But like I seen a TikTok last night and this girl was talking about um, she was basically talking about how she just deactivated her Instagram. She started posting on other sites. Now I will tell y'all, 
every piece of short form content that you see on my Instagram, I post it on my TikTok, I post it on my Facebook, I post it on my thread, and I post it as a YouTube short sometimes. So I, I already got in my mind to use other platforms outside of Instagram because a lot of people on my Instagram, I don't know if it's like this for a lot of other people, but I know it's like this for this girl that I'm gonna tell you about, the one that um, I seen last night on TikTok. She was like a lot of people on Instagram just face watch. And I kind of feel like that with my Instagram, like it's a lot of people that watch my story. Like they literally watch my story, but you know what I'm saying? When I post every piece of content that I drop, I drop a thumbnail on my story with the link to the reel and like a song or something. All you have to do is click it, go watch it, leave a comment, like it, share it, whatever you want to do. Bro, they don't even do that. And I ain't going to lie. Sometimes it be putting me in my feelings. But I be like, bro, I just got to keep going because with the crowd that I'm going to have, just like with my social media websites and with me, you know what I'm saying? on my uh, YouTube channel and stuff like that, bro, it's gonna be, I'm gonna reach a wide variety of people. Like, I'm gonna have so many different people watching me and sharing my stuff, like, it's not gonna matter, you know what I'm saying? Like, and it's crazy with a lot of this success stuff because they always say, man, like, it be the strangers that support you, which is crazy, but that's just life sometimes, you know what I'm saying? But I am appreciative of the people that do support me, that know me and stuff like that, man. I really appreciate y'all. It's just sometimes where I be feeling like, dang, like my content's so dope. So it's like, why is it not getting a like? Why is it not getting a share like? But I don't let that bring me down, man, because at the end of the day, this is my vision, this is my dream. So I just got to keep pushing, you, you know what I'm saying? I can't worry about stuff like that. I just decided I was going to try to just make like a little short blog today, man. And, uh... Try to keep it as simple as possible, just to just put some out, put some good content out. It's still gonna be good quality. You too. Smelling good, looking good, feeling good. You know what I'm saying? So look, man, I had to had to get back right, bro. But it smelled like sweat after running through my house. And uh yo. I got that right, man. And look, before y'all say anything, you know what I'm saying? For the people that peeped it, if, if you didn't peep it. Oh, well, but for the people that peeped it. I don't have my mats down because I had to wash them. And uh, I got to rewash them, bro, because I left them in there overnight. So I got to rewash them, put them in the dryer, and then I'm back right. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, bro, if you hadn't... Checked out my real that I brought yesterday. We only gonna play a little bit of it because I'm not trying to get copyrighted. Check me out. Check it in. Yeah. Nigga that got spoiled off these fucking PJs. Man, I'm telling you, bro. Before the end of the year, bro. My content is finna literally blow up, bro. Watch what I tell y'all, like, I'm only getting better with this. You know what I'm saying? So, I just gotta keep going. Same thing with y'all, bro. Y'all gotta keep going, like. Y'all just gotta keep going, you know what I'm saying? When, whenever you trying to achieve something, like, stuff might not work at the beginning. And I'm telling y'all this because it, it happens to me. Stuff might not be working, bro, at the beginning, but you just gotta keep pushing, man, for real. Bah. All right, bro, so look, let me give y'all one more piece of free game, right? I ain't even supposed to be getting y'all this, but I'm going to give it to y'all anyway, bro. All right, so if you're familiar with um Bath and Body Works, right, in the men's section, if you really want to have your woman just ah, all over you, you feel what I'm saying? Go get you some teak wood, bro. Teak wood, and this is a new pickup for me, the um Canyon. The Canyon smell is a... Uh, Probably what I'm gonna use today, man, cause when I go pick my girl up from the hair appointment, I want her to just go on and jump on me in the wheel. Don't even wait till we get home, just jump on me in the wheel, baby. <laughs> nah, I'm just talking. But yeah, bro, you'll put this on. After you put this on right here, you don't even have to spray on cologne, cause I ain't even gonna cap to y'all. I don't use this every day. I use a Vino lotion too, just the original, um, original scent with no smell on it. So if I use that lotion, what I do is I just go ahead and um 
I spray on cologne afterwards. Every time I get out of the shower, I spray on cologne, bro. Even when I go to sleep, I spray on cologne. I like to smell good 24-7. You feel what I'm saying? And you should too. Don't let nobody tell you different. But yeah, after I put the after I um get all of this stuff done, bro, I don't even have to put on no cologne. This is my cologne right here. And boom, just like that, we ready, we smelling good, man. We ready to tackle the day. All right, y'all, y'all saw. Fresh out of the shower, feeling good. Back to myself, right? So now, man, to make this day even better, got to get the Celsius, you know? Gotta get that Celsius. And it's so crazy, bro, because uh, the kiwi flavor from the original flavors of Celsius, that is my favorite flavor, right? But we ended up getting the Arctic box. We just got like a box from Sam's Club. And uh, it's the Fruit Punch. We have the um, Strawberry Lemonade. And we also have the Blue Riz Edition. This one right here, bro. Slapping Blue Riz, bro. It's probably my favorite flavor from the Celsius now. Like, kid y'all not, bro. I try to drink a Celsius probably like every three days. Um, I don't too much try to drink them every day, even though it is just sparkling water and stuff. So yeah, bro. If you, bro, I'm not gonna lie. I've really been putting a lot of people on Celsius. If you haven't been drinking Celsius, you need to get you a Celsius, bro. I'm telling you, like, you'll feel good, man, straight up. But uh, I got my Celsius. Now I gotta put some, some ice to the Stanley, bro. And what's so funny about this is, is that, bro, I remember I didn't even want a Stanley Cup because I'm not, like, I'm really not a big fan of Cups, you know? But, bro, ever since I got this Stanley Cup, I have non-stop been drinking out of it. Been drinking out of this cup non-stop, bro. And what's so crazy is I got this cup before me and Liv had went to um Detroit and stuff like that. That's what's so crazy. Go ahead and do that. Pop y'all look. Look at this. Check this out. You just pour it in there with the ice, man. You just pour it in there with the ice. I'm gonna be sipping on this all day, bro. Y'all ain't got your Celsius. Make sure you go get one, bro. Straight up. Now, since I got the Celsius. I gotta get into my daily emailing, email some people, email some more brands and stuff like that. You know, so uh, after I get done doing that, man, it should be time to go pick Liv up. I'm gonna take y'all with me to go pick her up. Let you see what that hair looking like. Every time she get her hair done, you know, I be hyping my girl up. So she's so ready for me to just come pick her up and hype her up, you know what I'm saying? So. I normally do it on Instagram. I might do it with both. I might hold the camera in one hand, Instagram in the other. That way I can show y'all what my baby look like and show Instagram what my baby look like, you know, because my girl fine, my girl bad, you know, and I love her to death, so. Right now, I'm currently finna go pick Liv up. She just texted me. And I'm like, she'll be done in about an hour. Let me see where the shop is located. Ah, oh, man, look at this hour. Where the shop is located, it's like 40 minutes away from the crib, man. So, by the time I get down there, she should be done, man. Stuff like that. And uh, hopefully, I can go ahead and beat this five o'clock traffic, bro. Because if you in Atlanta or you ever been to Atlanta around five o'clock during the week, bro, that traffic don't play. And then what's so crazy is I got to go all the way down there by the airport, the international side, just to pick her up from the shop. So yeah, man, I pray that uh, on the way back, we don't have to worry about any traffic for real. It could just simply just be a smooth transition down there and a smooth transition back you feel what i'm saying so yeah man let me get this air and stuff like that running real good in the wheel 
and I'll get back with y'all once I make it to my location to pick Lil, bro. It's none of my business, nigga be steadily giving opinions on shit they don't even concern them. I got a lot to get off on my sternum. I need to stop it, stop it. I live my life, I'm a knock, I'm a knock. Oh, girl, my bitch got a bubble gone poppin'. Fuck on Versace, yeah, I'm a new topic, and most of my grandma's from Bobby. I always wanted to profit. Don't I finally pick. made it down here, um, to the house shop, man, to pick up my beautiful woman. Right now, I'm waiting on her. I told her I was out here like eight minutes ago. She hasn't texted me back yet, but before I left the crib, she told me that the girl was on the last row, so I'll probably be waiting for like 10, 15 more minutes. Um, I'm ready for her to come out. Because once she come out, I just thought about something, man. I, I think I'm going to go ahead and run the Best Buy by the crib because I need to get another shotgun mic for my camera. And, you know, just so like when I vlog like this, I can make sure that I have the shotgun mic on top of my camera. So, you know, that way my audio can sound as good as possible, bro. I got to get that. And I'm also going to, not today, though, I'm going to get some Rode wireless mics that I'm going to get for my content as well, like for my short form content and stuff like that. Because I think I want to start switching up, like, my um, lifestyle videos sometimes to, like, just um, ASMR videos, just hearing me, like, when I'm in boxing class, just while I'm out chilling in the store and stuff like that. Like, I think that'll really be just dope. You feel what I'm saying? So, uh I'm gonna make sure I get those. That's on my list that I have to get to invest back into myself and my business. I got that rolled down on Amazon. They're like 300 bucks, but see, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I like going on Amazon and shopping for my stuff, but at the same time, I'm the type of person, like when I want something, I want it right then and there. So instead of me just waiting three to four days on something, I'd rather just go to Best Buy, buy it that way i got it and i can go ahead and use it what keith lee said man i got it let's try it let's use it my addition you get what i'm saying so yeah like i'd rather just do that but my girl like she really like amazon bro so a lot of times she gonna be like man you just need to order it off amazon da, 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 da. but when i want something i don't like waiting on it so i'm just going if it's a best buy near me man i'm gonna go ahead and get it and go ahead and do what i gotta do bro i cannot wait until i get my hair retwisted tomorrow bro I look like freaking Albert Einstein or somebody about to have. But it's cool though, man. Boy gonna shake back tomorrow. I gotta get a haircut too. That's gonna be on Friday because this weekend, bro, we have to go to Montgomery. My boy Jaren is having his album release party Saturday and he want me to record that. So I really need to go ahead and find, I really need to find uh, an outfit, man, you know, so I can look fly. I got stuff in the closet, but I think I wanna kinda go like blue jeans, shorts or something because really, me and Liv, we got a date next Tuesday at um this place in Dunwoody. I forgot the name of it that we want to try. Like, because when we was out there at Perimeter Circle eating ice cream, we was looking at it. We was like, dang, we need to go there because uh, we were seeing the people sitting outside and they was eating and stuff like that. And she was like, the food would look real good. So we're going to try to go ahead and go there, man, try that out and see what that's in for on Tuesday. Then I think on Sunday, which is Cinco de Mayo, we're supposed to be going on a double date with another couple um, that we know. You know what I'm saying? I might vlog that, ask them do they care about being on the camera and stuff. Because I ain't going to lie, bro. Like I told you, I'm trying to get y'all eight videos this month. I just want to be consistent with YouTube as possible. I know I'm going to still drop a lot of short form content, but I'm this month I'm more so focused on just trying to get out as many YouTube videos as I can and just film as much YouTube content as I can, man, because I really want to... Like I said, I really want to be successful with YouTube. So that's what I'm focused on, man. Yeah, so. But yeah, whenever she come out here, I'm going to get back with y'all. I'm going to get on Amazon and continue to um look at some more stuff that I want. And also, y'all, I'm going to be coming out with with my own Amazon storefront. So everything that I'm using for my content, man, y'all will just be able to click the link in the description box. See what I got to make my dope content and go purchase it from my storefront, man. You know, so yeah. Let me finish my creators list and I'm gonna get back with y'all when my shorty come out the door. YouTube, check out my sexy baby. <laughs> Looking so good and stuff like that. Ooh, baby, you look good, baby, with your little bubble hole, not little ball. Okay, you know this guy. Little BKB. You look good, yeah, baby. I swear you, you look like so it? sexy, baby. Okay. Ooh, I might have sold them toes tonight. All right, now. All right. Don't hurt them. I ain't not. But yeah, man, y'all, this is my baby, man. My baby looking real good. I that she just left for her appointment. She look good anyway. But yeah. I need to get my lashes done. Baby, you look beautiful, baby. Thanks, so. Oh, God, I got to hold your hand all day. Can't let you wander off too far.
I had, um, I told y'all I was gonna go to Best Buy, but when I went online and tried to look at the mics, the mic that I'm getting off Amazon, they didn't have, all they had were like, road mics, and those mics were like, $80, $90, which is a good price, but I'm not paying it. So, I'm gonna um, just order my Movo mic off of Amazon. It's like $39. I'm gonna go ahead and order that. And then, I wanna go ahead and try to order um, my SD cards too. I'm supposed to be getting like a five pack of 16 gigabyte SD cards. Cause all of mine are damaged and I'm finna just throw them all away. It's something that I've been needing to do for a long time, but I've been procrastinating with doing it. And I'm like, bro, I really just wanna, which I've been grinding with my content anyway, but I just wanna just make sure all of my stuff is in order with my content and everything. So, you know, procrastinating, we just gonna go ahead and do what we gotta do with that. And that's gonna be that, man. Finna get back in the crib. Probably uh, email some more people. Then Liv's supposed to be making some Southwest salads tonight. So we're gonna do that. And then, probably just chill out and find a movie. It was the show on Facebook that I had wanted, that I had saw. You want to watch um, it? Yeah, we can watch it. But yeah, it was the show on Facebook that I had ended up seeing, and I screenshotted it. So I'm gonna try to check that out after I get done with everything. And probably before I go to sleep, probably go ahead and edit this vlog so I can get this vlog to y'all tomorrow and or on Friday, cause tomorrow is Thursday and stuff like that. But yeah, man, um, I wanna go ahead and do that and everything. So probably finna go ahead and get ready to take cash outside. I ain't took him outside since this morning. And then, like I said, finish up. But I gotta finish up with emailing these people. Probably film a little bit showing y'all these crazy Southwest salads because the Southwest salads that we be making be crazy, like mouth water and no cow. And then go ahead, probably put this together. But if I don't, man, I'm just gonna enjoy the rest of my night, chill out, get ready for tomorrow. Might even sit on the patio, bro, because yesterday I ended up washing the little seat coverings because they had a lot of pollen on them. And I went on and watched those because Lil was like, she wanted to start back sitting outside because it's getting hot stuff like that so went on and took care of that but let me run cash outside i'm gonna get back with y'all later on once we start making these salads y'all stay tuned so wait bro i know i told y'all i was gonna get back with y'all after um once we start making these salads but i ain't gonna lie to y'all bro caramel and apples preferably the green apples bro check this out Best combo on the planet of Earth, man. I swear to God. I just started eating this, like, I just started eating this combo, like, three weeks ago. Matter of fact, on the way to Detroit was when I started eating this. If you've never tried the green apple with caramel, bro, try it. You will not regret it. Y'all know what time it is, man. It's dinner time. Um, so instead of us eating sour salads, Lil was just like, she didn't really feel like cooking. And uh, we basically gonna eat the same thing we ate last night. Last night, man, we ended up eating um, some spicy chicken sandwiches that was good, like great. You know what I'm saying? And it's crazy because I thought, I, I really need to go to Publix to grab some pickles or, um, the, um, it's some type of pep oh the pepperoncinis bro pepperoncinis are so good just so I can have with my sandwich but um we finna we got sweet pickles bro but I'm not a real big fan of sweet pickles so I don't know if I'm really eat those or not but I'm in charge of dinner tonight I'm finna go and put these sandwiches in the air fryer make the broccoli so we can eat it's 9 p.m. I'm starving I'm pretty sure she's starving too but if y'all are wondering about the chicken sandwiches I'm talking about, I'm talking about these right here. Um, normally when we get these, we get these from Sam's Club. But I think they sell them at other places too, like Walmart and stuff. I just know every time we get them, they be at Sam's Club. So we eat these. We're gonna eat these again. And yeah, I might have her go over there to get some pickles. She might not want to walk over there, but I'm gonna see if she will, y'all. 
First thing that I'm going to do is go ahead and get my water ready for the broccoli and stuff. Ah, I'm losing focus. Let me turn my eyes up. First thing I'm going to do, man, is get some water, put it here for the bottom of this for my broccoli so I can, um, so I can, um, All right, y'all, we back, man. I had to go to the store to get what I had to get. But the good thing is, now I don't have to put the broccoli on the stove. We just gonna do it in the microwave. So, that's even better. You know what I'm saying? Ain't got to do all that. Let me get this food with me, bro, because I am hungry as I don't know what. All right, y'all, so we gonna do three of these bad babies. Because I ain't gonna lie, I might eat two of these tonight. Bing. Got them in the air fryer. Also, one of the best things invented, bro, the air fryer. So, boom. Put that in there. We're going to go start, and we're going to go for the temperature, 360. And we're going to do 12 minutes on one side and flip it over. 360, four minutes on the other side. Let's do it. Food is done, man. We already ate the broccoli, and we ate a sandwich already. It's just, um, I had ended up, I had to go back to the store because somehow the buns got threw away. And, um, yeah, I had to go get some new buns from Kroger's. I got back home, bro. I was just ready to eat, so I ain't even show y'all the full plate. But I cooked three sandwiches because I knew we was going to want another one, so we split the last one in half. I was going to finish eating this sandwich. After I get done doing this, I have to clean my boxing gloves out for class in the morning. And I gotta put the bathroom mats down and straighten up the kitchen. And then I'll be good, man, to get in the bed and chill out for the night. I'm tired. Uh, I probably ain't gonna go to sleep though, because I normally stay at about 12, 1 o'clock. But yeah, man. New to this channel, make sure you subscribe to this channel. Turn on those post notifications to get this video a like. And I will see y'all in the next vlog.